next part I can solve some of the warp through. In the last episode, I explored Blackthorn City, took out all the rest of the battles as I could, and now we're back to challenge Claire, the ape and final gym leader of Johto. Let's see. I am Claire, the world's best dragon type master. I can only hold my own against even the Pokemon's League Elite 4. Do you still want me to take, take, you want to take me on? Fine, let's do this. As a gym leader, I will use my full power against my opponents. Okay, Claire, about to get started. She is a tough cookie to crack. Because. Or tough egg to, egg to crack, I don't know. She's got four Pokemon. The start of the Gyarados, level 38, or Flying Sight with the moves. Uh, uh, Dragon Rage, Thrash, Waterfall, and probably Bite. Or the, or, or, or the Ice Fang, depending. So. It's always best. You always start with Dragon Rage. You always get some power out of the way, so nothing will have to happen again. Usually, you try to use Waterfall in order to flinch, because it can flinch. And you've got to use a pretty good electric type in order to defeat it. So, may not far too, and then cut off my Gyarados out in one move. Because of its special attack. So, there goes Gyarados. That was quick. And next is Dragonair. Now, it's because Sparky is actually more powerful than Pokemon. And my next powerful is actually Hydro. Hydro. The thing I've done is obviously I, tr I tried to attempt to beat it in practice. And obviously I got beaten. But it's only so that I can get some power in. Rather than taking on the battle of damage Route 46. Which I will be taken care of after this battle. But... If that happens. So we'll just start with the Night Ice Fang. Occasionally you can fr freeze or um you know freeze or or flinch. But if it doesn't work then Dragon needs to find a way to annoy you to use Dragon Pulse next turn. Now she's got two Dragon Airs. Both with um Thunder Wave, Dragon Pulse, um Dragon and Dragon Rage. She's also got two, both, one of both of them. They've got a difference. They've got different types of moves up for the third move. One's got Fire Blast. One's got Thunderbolt. I think the, third, the, third, the second one's got Thunderbolt. This one's got, uh, got Fire Blast. So I'm gonna risk it. So sure, I'll use Dragon Pulse. Dragon Pulse is basically sort of a move that you'll be getting at the end of the battle. So I sang the finish. Dragon her off. And here comes the next dragon here. I'm probably going to allow this to happen. I'm gonna put Shadow in. Because Shadow can actually take out a dragon here. I've actually done I've actually attempted it and it works. As you might have seen in my battles against the other trainers before the for the gym leader. This probably is the one with the Thunderbolt included. So I'll see Shadow can go first because of its speed, because Dragon is quite slow. Yeah, obviously I'll confuse it. If it works. It does, that's good. If that's the case, I can use Shadow Ball and this will happen. Do this much damage. That is how much damage you can do. Please hurt yourself. Oh! Funny! That's what I always wanted. I always wanted it so that it works. It's not going to now. It's going to annoy me for the rest of the game. It's going to snap out of it and eventually it doesn't... Uh, I don't mean, know. Uh, so I'll use a Shadow Ball and see if I can kill it. Yep. That takes out uh, Dragonair. And he's got a lot of experience like that. So I'm now going to put in... I think I might have ruined the strategy here. But the only thing I can do, obviously, yeah, I think it can work. Just got to sort of put it in the right perspective. Got to sort of move, do the right moves in order to move, do the right moves before I can do it. So I'm going to do this. Obviously, I can accept the hydro pump because it can survive unless it's a critical hit, which it isn't. 
you know, you find a way. It's always best to go in sort of say the parafusion way, which is basically paralysis and confusion ray put together. Because even if you do get through confusion, you can still be paralysed, and that is a, and this is sort of an easy thing to get. So I'm going to at least accept a discharge against Kingdra. Let's get at least get some damage in. Dragon Pulse off the hits and to beat Sparky. So I'll see Sparky's gone. This is quite a hard battle to do because because you got to sort of pick the right Pokemon there. Obviously, it's not the right Pokemon to use, but I'm going to help it out. My I'm using my use for Firefox. Um, I'm using that so I can do Parafusion. There we go. I'm not going to use. Um, I'm not going to try and use a uh, Bolt Firefox a lot. I'm going to use it soon, but not all the time. So as you can see, confusion is not really taking much of an effect. So I've got to try and uh, do something different. I've got to try something different there. How should I try it? So I have that, or I can do this. I could try and use. I could try and put, put a couple of screeches in. If I can put a couple of screeches in. All I can do is just get. Pidgeotto, my ace fly, if you use one fly attack and it'll defeat it. Just let it hit. Oh, paral oh yes, paralysation. It's always working. And Screech is taking some good effect. And, well, it's probably stuck out soon. But not at the moment. And paralysis is working. Come on, get a third. Yes, third Screech. I want to, this is my strategy. I just want to basically do it this way and see if it works. See, it hurts. Oh <laughs> my goodness. You just get some Citrus Bay back up. Um, let's try something. Let's see how much damage Rock 2 will do. Woo! Ah, oh, damn it. And it's got a lot of, a lot of, um, you know, a lot of damage. You know what? I think I'm going to... It's obviously going to probably use... Um, probably use Hyper Potion. Or Full Restore, because it's got Hyper Potion or Full Restore. Anything can happen. So... It uses Hyper Potion. If, it, if you get it down to zero, you get, if you get down towards Red Zone again, it's going to use Full Restore. And it's going to take out that Paralysis. So you got to make sure that you either... Because I was thinking of another strategy, if it does happen to get to that point, you should be prepared for it. See there, sorted. There we go, Pidgeot got it. Pidgeot has got that win. How did it? Oh yeah, okay. Fly, hits, Kingdra hits, there it goes. There we go, A5. King goes down, Ace Flyer gets the victory, well done Ace Flyer, stroke of victory. So that's actually the best way to defeat a Kingdra. You use a load of screeches from any po from a Pokemon that knows it, all probably some status affecting moves that involves it. So when you win, you just say, I'm not conceding this, I might have lost, but you're still not ready for the Pokemon League. I don't know, you should take the Dragon Master Challenge. Okay, she's telling me that I'm not worthy of a badge unless this Dragon Master Challenge is, well, completed. So she's telling me to do this and she's saying behind the gym is something called Dragon Fix. There's more of a shrine for dragon types. And he tells she tells me to go there and prove that You say I'm lazy. Okay. You'll be kidding me. So this transporter gets you back towards the start of the gym. So let's 